All right, we are back here in Forza Motorsports, and we are in the Group C cars, uh, the GTPC cars, and we are once again going to be in the self-promotion mobile in the Mercedes-Benz C9. I really love this car. I have a new tune on it. I think it does really, really well. Um, so let's jump in the first race and see how it goes. Thanks again for watching. A little sprinkle, not too much of anything yet, luckily. I should have known, known that was coming. Like a, an okay run out of there, it wasn't great, but I've definitely been worse. Oh, rev bounce, that's not gonna help. back into this track is where we're going to get a lot better positions considering we have a lot better downforce than a lot of these guys do. Oh! Yeah, this guy definitely does not break very quickly at all. Just have to be weary of that. I was gonna try to slip under, but he was a little wiggly there, and I didn't feel like it'd go well, so. Oh, we should have been in first, but. Now we're too far back, we won't be able to go under him to get around him on this first corner and then we're gonna kind of be stuck behind him now, unfortunately. Come on. We don't have all day. You can't just stop here. We have avoidable contact. We lost so much time through there on these guys. Oh no, we're off track by a little bit. 
Oh no, okay. I like how that guy said thanks. I mean like was it really my fault? Like I went under you, I was side by side and you decided to cut over. I could have actually pushed him, but I didn't. Like, I was letting off the gas and pumping it. To make sure we didn't bump. Okay, we're getting a gap on the guy behind, and we're catching the guy in front here. And I think the next two laps are going to be the ones that will determine how well it's going to go, because, uh... Those are going to be the wet laps, if it's anything like the previous races. And here's to hoping, because if it isn't, uh, my strategy's not going to go well at all. up to one of these guys that went into the gravel. my best through there but we are still sticking with the guy in front pretty good Bouncing it. Oh man, he hit the barrier. We see any rain. Yeah, we got the windshield wipers on. We're going rain. Rain tires, rain tires. Pretty sure everyone knows this by now to do rain. I'd be kind of surprised that, um, well, I am kind of surprised that some of these guys stayed out. Tail is a little tail happier than I thought it would be. Okay, not sure what that was all about. Maybe some uh, network. What is that called? Ah, whatever. It's just some disconnect there. So hopefully, it doesn't bump us again. Well, someone had a spin here. Yep, the guy that was not on wet tires is. Way more rain than previously. Well, I thought there's previously on this lap. So it's definitely a good idea to go to wets. Oh, 
Okay, come on. There we go. Caught up by four seconds to that section on first. Yeah, first is uh, hurting. Good for us, though. That means we will have a good chance of catching a lot of these guys. Yeah, the guy that all these guys that haven't pitted yet, they're kind of SOL. Now we're just four seconds off the actual, or sorry, 11 seconds off the actual leader. And we'll see how he does, I guess. I mean, in the rain, if they have a really low downforce setup, like a lot of people do, we might not be able to run these corners as quick as, uh, we can a little bit more downforce here. Even though we're not really running these corners that well either. I didn't really want to risk sliding off. Some really wet weather. All the way up in third. And we're three seconds off of second. being this much water on the last time I ran this. I thought there was light rain last time, but this is heavy rain. Okay, it looks like the guy in front of, or in first, was running a lot of downforce. On his setup and planning for the rain. Probably was a good idea. I ended up taking a little bit of downforce out of our tune just to make sure we got bit better speed. But still has a lot more downforce than a lot of people run. in front of us here definitely breaks a lot later than we do. bad through there for us. Oh.
Oh, oh, keep it together there, yeah. Yeah, a far ways off from the 323 we ran in uh, qualifying. Wanted to make sure we didn't get any more penalties there. Uh, so we finished in third. Definitely a very, very wet race. And... Uh, Definitely not a downside to running some higher damp force on this track when you're doing the rain. Uh, just make sure you might have slower first two laps, but you'll be way, way better in the rain. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks again for watching.